This is an obviously sad ending to this search for Molly Tibbetts. As you mentioned, investigators say they have charged an undocumented immigrant with first degree murder, and they say he offered some pretty chilling details about what happened the night Molly disappeared. For more than a month, family and friends of Molly Tibbetts held out hope that somehow she would be found alive. This morning, they're grieving. A body believed to be Molly's found Tuesday in a cornfield. Utter disbelief. Just in shock. It's just been hard. A 24-year-old undocumented immigrant, Christian Bahena Rivera, charged with first-degree murder. How did he get on your radar? We came across an individual that had security cameras, and through that, we were able to identify a vehicle that we believe belonged to Mr. Rivera. Officials say Rivera, who came to the U.S. from Mexico, told them he pursued Molly during her run last month, at one point parking his vehicle and running behind and alongside her. He tells us that Molly grabbed a hold of her phone and said, you need to leave me alone, I'm gonna call the police. And then she took off running, he in turn chased her down. And then he tells us that at some point in time, he blacks out. Officials say Rivera told them as he was driving later, he saw an earpiece from headphones in his lap, realized he had put Molly in the trunk and noticed blood on the side of her head. He then dragged her into a cornfield. No motive was given for the killing. It seemed that he followed her and seemed to be drawn to her on that particular day. And for whatever reason, he chose to abduct her. Vice President Pence, who had reportedly met with the family last week, tweeted he was heartbroken by the news. President Trump speaking about the case at his rally overnight. The illegal alien coming in very sadly from Mexico. And you saw what happened to that incredible, beautiful young woman. Should have never happened. Just days before Molly's body was found, her family determined to find her. We're still optimistic. We'll bring Molly home. This tragic ending, one they hoped they'd never have to face. Christian Bahena Rivera is being held on a million dollar bond. He is due in court later this afternoon. Now, late last night, the company that employed him, Yerby Farms, said he worked for them for four years, that he was an employee in good standing, and that they properly vetted him through the federal government's E-Verify system. Guys? Ron Force there in Iowa. Ron, thank you. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.